Hey guys, Lester, and welcome back to another Pixelmon video here on the channel. Today we're going to be uh, we're going to be making a guide on how to catch the legendary Pokemon Arceus. Yes, that is right. Arceus has a well, the way of summoning him is the same, but there's a whole new way to locate his structure, as you might see here. Uh, it's going to get pretty crazy with this explanation, so let's get started. Of course, as always, if you guys have been enjoying the, uh, the little guides I've been doing for the different Pixelmon on the channel, smash the like button, share support, consider subscribing if you're new. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about how to get Arceus, feel free to comment them down below after watching the video, and I'll try my best to answer them if I haven't done so already. But yeah, the first thing you're going to want to locate is where this structure, this giant shrine is. It's called uh, the Chalice Dungeon Structure, whatever you like to call it. Uh, if you have trouble finding it, it can spawn in any ocean or extreme hills biome. Uh, you are going to want to use slash locate space Pixelmon land underscore chalice, and that's how you get the land one. However, what's very funny about this is I uh, this is actually spawned right next to it. Here's the water one right over here. I'll show you guys. So yes, you can find this new uh, structure that, that is where you summon Arceus. You can get it in both land and water. Here's the water one. You can see the chalice is right down there, which is where you summon Arceus. Uh, and this one, ironically, generated right next to the land one. Now, the land one's actually a bit more difficult because it is guarded. Um, ignore the Arceus statue on the top. That was for the thumbnail. But on top of you being in this random abandoned Arceus worshipping village, if you guys have played Legends Arceus, you'll probably understand why this is like this. Um, in the actual structure itself, you, as you can see here, there is Team Galactic members, some pretty high levels too, as well as a Rare Boss Cyrus, which is the leader of Team Galactic, and Rare Boss means that his Pokemon will be 10 levels above your max. So, you are going to have to defeat all these grunts before summoning Arceus, and I only say that because they're going to be difficult to defeat, however, if you're someone like me, you can just kind of, uh, uh, can't I, like, pop you? Isn't there a way to delete you? I can't delete him. Okay, I guess because he's part of the structure, I can't delete him. I was going to get him out of the way, just do this in survival. But I guess I'm doing it in creative. That's fine. Um, okay, so to get Arceus, you're going to want to obtain a few things before coming here. You're going to want to obtain all 17 plaints. Meadow, Flame, Splash, Sky, Insect, Toxic, Zap, Mind, Stone, Earth, Dread, Spooky, Iron, Fist, Icicle, Draco, and Pixie. There are 17 plates in total. If you know how Arceus works, you know what these are all for. You're going to want to acquire one of each of these at the very least. And then come to the shrine with all 17. You're also going to acquire the Azor Flute, which is another drop that you can get. All these items are from tier specific drops in the Pixelmon mod. You can defeat bosses. You can defeat uh, raid dens to get them, etc. Uh, they're all incredibly... I wouldn't say easy to get, but... Um, you kind of just got to make your rounds through them. But once you acquire all of the place, you're going to want to head up to this shrine. Like I said, defeat Cyrus if you would like. Um, and then you're going to want to right click every single plate into this chalice. All right, that's all these. And as you can see, as I'm doing it, uh, it is spawning little particles around the area, indicating that I'm doing this correctly. And these are all used once you do it. Even creative, as you see, I am using up every single plate. Uh, and once all the plates have been, you know, initiated into the summon circle, you're going to want to play the flute. Let's do it. As you can see, all the particles are going into the chalice. And we are going to end up summoning a flute. Okay, guys, we're back. My apologies. Uh, I misread the wiki. So, the flute can be acquired from, like, uh, tier raid dungeons and stuff. Um, but that is the other way of getting the flute. But once you get the flute, you're going to want to come to the time space altar, which is at Spear Pillar. Which, if you guys want to know how to get Spear Pillar, just do this locate command or just find it in your world. This is also where you get Dialga, Palkia, and Giratina. But... The way he says, once you come here with the Azor Flute, you right-click the ground. Oh, there we go. Okay, and it will do the summoning animation for Arceus. There he is. And, like how it how it works, you, you will fight a level 80 Arceus. So, I'm going to uh, attempt to beat him with my level 100. Because, you know, Arceus does drop some things. It's not like he doesn't do all of the things. Uh, for those that don't know, Arceus will spawn as a normal type. If you want to know how to switch his versions, uh, it has to do with the plates. I believe it's whatever plate he's holding. 
will determine uh, what he, you know, gets for his uh, abilities and whatnot. But let's defeat Arceus really quickly. So upon defeating Arceus, there's a few things you can actually get from him. Uh, you have a 100% chance to drop for him to drop 1 to 5 gold. There's a 50% chance for him to drop 1 XP share, a 30% chance to drop 1 Elytra, and a 10% chance to drop 1 XP all, which is really funny that you're getting XP all this late in the game, but you know. Um, but yeah, that is the entire guide on how to successfully acquire Arceus. It's probably the most steps out of everything in Pixamon uh, so far, from what I've seen. Uh, but hey, that that's the kind of lengths that we have to go to. Also, shout out to this area. If you guys want the seed for this Pixmon world, here you go. Literally next to this this uh, the um, spear pillar, we have uh, I think that's a raid den over here. Yeah, there is there's literally a raid den right here, which is really cool. Um, right next to the raid den, there's a village over there. Like, this is actually a pretty cool seed generation. Um, but either way, that is going to do it for this Arceus guide. Again, I'm sorry I kind of fumbled up. Oh, there's another raid den over there. I'm sorry I fumbled up a little bit on how to get Arceus. Uh, I always thought it was the, the flute at uh, the, the chalice itself. But I remember specifically messing that up last time too. And I did this in survival. Either way, that's going to do it for this video. I do hope you all have a great day. Stay safe, everyone. Goodbye.